guys while I am out of here. I will be back. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but I will film when I go inside. I love you. You're love gonna you. do great. Thanks, baby. It's gonna be okay, I promise. I love you. Did you stay in the car? Come here. Come on, buddy. Good morning, guys. I just dropped Libby off at the hospital. She's getting checked in. I think they just took her back to her room. I know Libby's gonna have more to say once she gets all the tests done and talks to the doctor and she gets her ultrasound. I don't know if she's gonna have her results today, but I do know she has been feeling very nervous and kind of scared about this whole thing because she is kind of like a worrier. So if you guys wanted to like say something positive and nice down in the comments below, I know she would really appreciate that and I know like this family literally everybody has everybody's back and this like spreading positivity and happiness is literally the best thing for like everybody and she just texted me and said she's really scared because um, there's a bunch of like women in there and like breast cancer signs and obviously like Libby is scared of that and like her aunt just um passed away with breast cancer so like this is a very serious thing and not something to like play around with but you know I, I just told her like um just be positive be upbeat be happy because that can rub off on somebody else and even if you are okay you might be able to make someone else's day who is going through something very serious and very scary so um i don't that's not saying libby like she doesn't have an answer yet but like i just told her just be happy and be optimistic and you know whatever happens happens and we're gonna deal with it okay guys so they just did the imaging and she's gonna go show the doctor and then the doctor is gonna come in and tell me um, the results I'm like praying that it's nothing but like low-key I want to cry because it's like it's just scary not knowing and I kind of want my mom right now but I'm praying to God that it's nothing but like anyone who's going through this my love and prayers go to you because this is scary let's just pray i'm okay oh, it's scary oh my god okay. it's got a good cry out and i talked to my mom i'm gonna try to stop crying i'm fine i think guys like they said they think it's a fibroid i should probably know the right word like a cyst some type of cyst yeah but they want me to they kind of gave me the option they're like you can either get a biopsy to know you're 100% fine or you can come in every six months for the rest of your life <laughs> I'm like I'll just get it biopsied yeah. that's a lot just to like, be safe and um, so yeah I have to make that appointment but I think that just the tears are more like overwhelming being in that situation it's scary and I have two family members that have passed away from breast cancer so it's like it's just really real and I just just kept thinking of all the women in that waiting room with me and like you know how many of them might actually have breast cancer I don't know it's just really hard like I see you saw that previous clip like I just wanted my mom am I leaking <laughs> you got smart running it's okay uh, I think they gave me a tissue yeah they did um <laughs> but yeah it's just like I love living in Florida but sometimes I just like want my mom <laughs> the distance can be hard but yeah thank you guys for all the prayers if you prayed from the last video like I think I'm okay Obviously the biopsy will give me 100% the answer, but they seemed pretty confident. Biopsy, like you guys know how much I hate needles. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I'll be up. Oh my gosh. This guy There's better. a big truck just trying to back up next to Hunter. Oh, that's scary. Just take up two spaces, my guy. But I think the biopsy they said, like, it's, um. Whoa, 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 whoa needles like a needle so they'll like numb you with novocaine and then they'll like poke a needle in there to like grab some of the the mass and then they'll oh my god he is completely running over that sign 
Oh gosh. Sorry, baby. The drama. The people. There's some just not very good drivers out there. He, there's literally like the metal stakes in the sign with, <laughs> with like no parking or like 15 minute park. And they hit it. He just completely ran over it. It happens. I'd probably do that too with in a the truck cement. that big. It's a big truck. But uh, I need some breakfast and some Starbucks or something. You deserve it. Anything you want right now, baby. <laughs> Thanks, babe. <laughs> Guys, Juice was so cute. Like, when he saw me, he was so happy. It's crazy how, like, your dog can, like, sense that sadness or whatever. At least I think he could, or he was just excited. He might have just been excited, like, his normal <laughs> self. But that's all we're going to say. Yeah, and he knows. <laughs> but, oh. I love you guys all so much. And I love you. And I'm so yeah, proud of you. Too. You're going to be okay. Yeah. I think, like, I mean, that's great news, right? Like, they didn't think anything of it, right? Like, they thought it was pretty good. And the fact that they gave me the option to not have to get a biopsy, like, made me feel better. But they were happy with my decision just to be safe. Yeah. But. And guys, like I said, like, even though we were praying that Libby's going to be okay, but I... I just try to tell her, try to just be optimistic, be positive because you never know what somebody else around you is going through and like how you can affect their life, you know? So if you can shed some type of positivity <clears throat> on them or, you know, just share a smile with them, like that could help their life out so much. Yeah, for sure. I tried to be super sweet there and like thanking the nurses yeah. for being so nice to me because uh, that was a very nice hospital. You know how I dumped on my doctor last time? Like, if I went here, I would feel good. Like, this is a really nice hospital. People were agreeing with you, though. They said, like, Florida Healthcare isn't... No, my dad was warning me about that when I moved here. But, but I also said it was the city. Yeah. And this is obviously a, a lot, lot nicer. nicer. Like, yeah. everyone was so nice in there and, yeah. like did their job super fast like not fast but like they got me in they like did everything they needed to it was clean it was organized they gave me freaking like little bag that was kind of cute i showed you guys that and the pink robes it's just oh that one room like it was all like breast cancer um decorated and i was just like oh my gosh like, yeah. it's just that really started getting to me just how real it is but I'm very blessed for my health overall because I am a very healthy person. I'm thinking this is just a cyst, but you guys are here for the journey. We'll see when the biopsy results finally come back. So, I guess that'll probably be in I'm, I'm, next I mean, video. I'm guessing next or the video after because they said after the image, after the biopsy takes three days. So we won't know. Yeah, so you guys will probably find out in the next couple of videos when we do the biopsy and get the results in but i like kind of feel bad like this is getting dragged out longer because hunter and i do really want to go back to ponds because like <laughs> in st pete you know we have roommates it's just like a lot with juice yeah and i feel like this just keeps getting dragged out way longer but obviously health is so important it is your your life and your <laughs> Safety and healthiness is the most important thing. So More important than lack of sleep. I've been <laughs> napping so much. <laughs> Power naps are good. They Power are. naps are good for everyone. It's but okay. <laughs> I don't know, we'll probably film a little bit more today so this video is more interesting. It's kind of a poopy day here. Yeah, I don't want this to be like a damper on everybody's lives watching this. We still want it to be like a positive, like yeah. learning thing, like, you know, watch this and go spread some positivity <clears throat> and happiness to somebody else. Yeah. Try to make somebody else's day better. For sure. Maybe that can be our message today. Yeah. That's going to be our message. We'll go to Starbucks. Of and course. <laughs> we'll go get some food because your girl is so hungry. Starbucks or Dunkin' though? I think Starbucks is right there. Oh, okay. We passed it. Oh, we're we going to try Jersey Mike's. Oh, yeah. We're going to try their breakfast. We're going to try a new breakfast spot. Yeah, we're going to go there. And there's Starbucks right next door. That'll make me happy. <laughs> But I love you guys so much, and we'll see you when we get to Starbucks. We'll show them what we get. We love y'all. Yes, bitch. So, guys. No, stay. Ju juice. No. Get back. Just pause on my boo. Get, get, juice. Juice, get back. He smells the whipped cream. Juice. You're not supposed to be up here. So, guys, it was my lucky day. I had a free Starbucks because I had 150 stars. So I got a venti chai latte with sweet cream and then a small cup of ice. And so this had no ice so that I could pour it in here. And now I have another one for tomorrow. No. 
<laughs> Isn't that smart, babe? That's so smart. I didn't really hear what you said. <laughs> Can I have a drink? All right, guys. We were going to go to Jersey Mike's, but it's closed till 10. So now we're going to clean juice. Oh we're going to get God. either avocado toast or smoothie bowls or like a juice. My treat. Because Hunter you know, bought, baby, you deserve you it. You bought ice cream last night, remember? Yeah, but... It's fair. But I feel like this is your day. Mm-mm. No? I can pay. Jeez, he is so excited. Clean juice it is. Oh, it's because it's juice. Oh my god, I didn't clean even realize juice. this is his name. It's you. But he knows. Not, he's not clean though. It's like when he went to Go Juice, he I knew. Know. He just knows it's his spot. Can you sit? They ordered for a picture for the social media. Should we have him pulling it? <laughs> oh my god. This is awesome. Oh my god. Oh no, god. Fight it. Fight it, buddy. <laughs> Okay, guys, so we Come have here. juice. We, got a, we do have a juice right here. We do here. have a juice. Also, did you guys see that they were taking a picture of him <laughs> for their social media? But you're famous. So, I don't know what you pack. charge for uh, for merchandising or like brand deal. Just a pet. Just a pet. Some love. Oh, it's for free. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But we got juice and we got carrot, orange, pineapple, lemon, turmeric. Looks fire. It does look fire. Good for the body. Go for the soap. And then we got a smoothie bowl. Can you get it juice. under control? My guy? Like seriously? Oh my gosh. You you're being not a good boy right now. GG. Juice you, boy. You wanna Come play mommy? Oh I love. I've been getting so much love today, guys. We took a nap and so then we went outside and played with Juice and he got to meet a bunch of people because everybody loves Juice Boy. Somebody came up to us in the apartment today and she was like, is this the famous dog? It's like, is this the famous dog everybody's talking about? Juice. And I was like, um, I don't know, I guess, maybe. <laughs> but he loved her. I was like, her. he is famous. She's actually like the cleaning person of the apartment. She loves him. He yeah, loves and he loves her. Yeah. But we love you guys so much, and I just wanted to say like that might have been a really sad and hard video for some of you to watch, but like we always say, we want to get vulnerable with you guys. We want to be real, and that's exactly what we did. Just yeah. kind of showed the raw emotions of what I went through today. But I get my biopsy done in about a week, a little over a week, so we'll have the for sure answers then. The official results. Yeah. If you guys want us to film that day on top of this one, let us know in the comments down below. But thank you guys so much for being part of our journey, and we love you guys so much. We love you guys, and thank you so much for all the prayers and like the happy comments for Libby. Like, yeah. I actually meant so much yeah. reading all of those and how much you guys were praying for me and thinking of me, so. We love this family, guys. So spread much. Spread some happiness, spread some positivity to somebody. Go make somebody's day. Yeah, and we'll see you. You feel me? You feel me? You feel me? And we'll see you in the next video.